Hello and welcome to today's English lesson. My name is Anas and I am a teacher in the International Knowledge School. Today's lesson is going to be on page 130 and 131 in the English book. Uh, we're going to talk about animal puzzles. So, a puzzle is like a riddle. So, there are a group of questions that you have to guess what they mean or what they represent. So, before we do the puzzle, we just have to go through the answers or the animals that we have. So, first we have rabbits. We are rabbits. So, two rabbits. I'm a giraffe. A giraffe. I'm a monkey. A monkey. We're owls. Owls. We're ducks. Ducks. We're elephants, elephants. I'm a hippo, hippo. Okay, so now we're going to go through the questions and try to match these puzzle pieces together. So each of the blue ones here goes with one of the orange ones, which have the animals. So let's start with the first one here. We've got big ears long noses and we're very big what are we let's see big no big ears long noses and they're very big rabbits rabbits are small so no giraffes giraffes are tall but not that big monkeys aren't big elephants have long noses all right they've got long noses Big ears, they have big ears, and they're very big. So it must be elephants. We're elephants. So what do we do? We match the blue one here with the elephants. So it just match them like this. All right, great. So the first one is elephants. Big ears, long nose, and they're very big. What are we? We're elephants. Good. Now, moving on to the next one. We're soft. This is soft. Soft. And white. White is the color. This is white. We've got long ears. Long ears. And fluffy tails. This can be soft and fluffy soft is a sort of thing that is very nice to touch fluffy is like this it's got hair it's like fur at the back or in it so what are we let's see so we already have the elephant so that it can't be the elephant let's see we're soft and white rabbits are soft and white We've got long ears. They've got long ears. And a fluffy tail. It must be bunnies. So, what are we? We're rabbits. We're rabbits. So, what do we do? We match the blue one here with rabbits. Okay, very good. So, let's put a cross here. So, we're not confused the next, uh, ad with the next question. Okay, I've got long arms, long arms, and a long tail. What am I? Let's see. It can't be the giraffe. It needs long arms and a long tail. It has a tail, but it isn't very long. And long arms, it doesn't have long arms. Let's see. Monkeys, it's got long arms and a long tail so it must be a monkey so i've got long arms and a long tail what am i i'm a monkey so what do we do we match the blue one here with the monkey all the way okay very good okay next Look at my big mouth. I can swim. I've got little ears. 
Remember we had big ears. Now we have little ears. Little is the opposite of big. Big, little. Big, little. So, look at my big mouth. I can swim. I've got little ears. What am I? So, it can't be the monkey. We already did that. Let's look here. We have, I'm a giraffe. Hmm, a giraffe has a big mouth. A giraffe can't swim. And it's got little ears. Hmm. So, it has a big mouth and little ears, but it can't swim. So, let's move on and see what else do we have. Owls. Hmm, big mouth. No, owls have a small mouth. It can swim. No, owls can't swim. I've got little ears. Okay, so it only has little ears, but it has a little mouth. So, it's not owls. Here, big mouth, it can swim, and it's got little ears. So, I'm a hippo. Look at my big mouth. I can swim. I've got little ears. What am I? I'm a hippo. So, you match this one here with the hippo. Okay, great. I've got a very, I've got very long legs and a very long neck. Very long legs and a very long neck. I like to eat leaves for my dinner. What am I? Well, let's start from the left. Here, I've got very long legs. Okay, so these are long legs. I've got a very long neck. And I like to eat leaves for my dinner. What am I? I'm a giraffe. I'm a giraffe. So, we can match a giraffe with the one we just read. Okay, very good. So again, I've got very long legs. Legs here. Very long neck. This is a neck and it's very long. And I like to eat leaves for my dinner. What am I? I am a giraffe. I am a giraffe. Okay, very good. Next one. We live in trees and we fly at night. We've got big eyes. What are we? Hmm, let's see. We live in trees, fly at night. We've got big eyes. So, trees, fly at night and very big eyes. Let's see. So, it can't be the rabbit. We already did that before. It can't be the giraffe. We just did that. It can't be the monkey. Not the elephant. Not the duck. So, it's either the owls or the hippo. So, let's see which one it is. We, let's, let's start with the owls. We live in trees. Yes, owls live in trees. They fly at night. Yes, they fly at night. We've got big eyes. So, what are we? We're owls. We're owls. So, we can match it right here. Let's put a cross. And again, they live, we live in trees. We fly at night. And we've got big eyes. What are we? We're owls. We're owls. Okay. We've got short legs. Our feet are orange. And we love to swim. We've got short legs. Our feet are orange. And we love to swim. What are we? Hmm. Here. Short legs. Feet are orange. And they love to swim. We're ducks. What are we? We're ducks. Now, here, these two are very easy to confuse. Why? Because they both have orange legs and they both love to swim. So, what's the difference? Hmm, look, this one says, What am I? This one says, What are we? 
Yes. So the difference is in the pronoun. So here it says, I am a hippo. And here, what am I? Here, what are we? We're ducks. So this is the biggest difference between the ducks and the hippos and this exercise. So if you look back, we look at the pronoun here. What are we? We're ducks. What am I? I'm a hippo. One more difference is that the hippos have short or small ears. Ducks don't have any ears at all. So that's one of the biggest difference between the two of them. Okay, so let's go for review very quickly. Here, big ears. So ears can either be big or small. Big ears, small ears. Okay, long noses. So the nose can either be small or short or long. Short nose, long nose. Again, short nose, long nose. Okay, soft and white. Soft and white. Just like the bunnies or the rabbits. Fluffy, fluffy, remember? Like this, it's fluffy, fluffy, like this. Okay, long arms, long arms. So arms can be long or they can be short. Long arms, short arms, long arms, short arms, okay. A long tail. Let's look at the monkey here. Long tail. So tails can be long or short. Long tail. Short tail. Okay, good. Here, look at my big mouth. So it can have a big mouth or a small mouth. Big mouth small mouth big mouth small mouth it's got little ears remember big ears little ears big ears little ears here long legs so let's look at the legs here long legs short legs long legs short legs long neck so this is the neck of course for animals like the giraffe this is the neck i've got a short neck the giraffe has a long neck so short neck long necks short neck long neck good okay here I've got very long legs, very long neck, and I like to eat leaves for dinner. Good. We live in trees, we fly at night, we've got big eyes. So we have two things, big eyes, small eyes, big eyes, small eyes. Okay, good. We've got short legs, our feet are orange, and we love to swim. So, orange is the color. So, feet are orange. Just like the duck. The duck has orange leg, or feet as well. Okay, now that we finished that exercise, we're going to go here at this last very small exercise. What have they got? Hmm, let's see. Now, this is a mouse. It looks like a mouse. Hmm, what does it have? What are these? What do we call these? Hmm. We call them ears. Remember? Ears. Are they big ears or small ears? Can you guess? That's right. These are big ears. So let's write it down. Big ears. Let me try that again. Big ears. Okay, good. Hmm, looks like a small 
nose small nose okay what else mice or a mouse is very small so we can say very small so we've got big ears small nose and it's very small in size elephants are very big a mouse is very small okay good what else can we add here hmm. three is good for each one okay let's look at this one here looks like a monkey hmm. it's got what is this remember the same thing what is this long tail long tail okay what are these they look like ears ears are they big or small ears that's right big ears good what about the arms are they long or short arms hmm they look very long so we call these long arms okay so you've got a long tail big ears and long arms okay let's move on very good hmm looks weird let's look at the tail remember what kind of tail is this do you remember fluffy very good so we have a fluffy tail all right it's very slow so you can write with me fluffy fluffy tail okay hmm it's got small ears small ears let's what else hmm a short neck we can call the short neck as well short neck long neck so look at the giraffe it has a long neck but this one here has a short neck so short neck okay very good hmm let's look at this one here it's got what do we call this remember short tail short tail good what else hmm we've got small ears as well small small ears what else does it have they look like long arms right yeah we can call them long arms okay let's look at this one here hmm I can see very big eyes from the owl the same as the owl it has big eyes you can write big eyes what else big feet big feet what else do they have hmm what are these small ears small ears
Okay, very good work on this one. Now, for today's homework, we're going to go to the same unit in the workbook, the practice book. So let's get that book very quickly. So here we're on unit 15 and that was the first exercise. Now the homework for today, we're going to go to unit 15, reading and understanding. Unit 15, page 104, reading and understanding. So here we're going to read about these animals here. So we want to read and understand what they're saying and each under each picture, okay? And then we're going to write about the animals we just read about. So here, the first one is, what flies at night? Let's see, we have to read each one of these and then answer the question, what flies at night? We will answer these questions in the next lesson and we'll see if you did them right or not. If you did them correctly, that's great. If you didn't, that's okay. We all make mistakes and we learn through them. Thank you for watching. I'll see you at the next lesson. Goodbye.